Hello there, I'm Tim Kern, half of the finance couple, and welcome to Two Minutes with Tim, where we look to infuse financial planning with just a little bit of common sense. Now, common sense, let's talk about common sense being applied to picking stocks. We get this question a lot. A lot of people say, do y'all pick individual stocks for yourself or for your clients? And the answer is no. Why? Because it doesn't make any sense. Let me tell you how we got there. And we've been doing this, I've been doing this for 27 years and everything that we do, we like to base on research. So we stepped back a long, long time ago and said all things being equal between an individual investor and a financial advisor, you would think that the financial advisor might be better at picking individual stocks, right? Again, all things being equal, who would be better at picking individual stocks, a financial advisor or a manager of some fund or what have you, where all they do is research companies and stocks and all that. And they don't even talk to clients really, that they just, their whole profession is picking individual stocks. So again, all things being equal, this professional money manager, if you will, should be better than the advisor who should be better than the individual investor. But when you go dig into the research, and I do this year in, year out, okay? When you look at the research, you see that these professional managers who are supposed to be better than everybody else just are not that good. And, and again, this is our opinion based on all the research we've done. I encourage you, go do your own research because all these money managers who pick individual stocks, they have to have, or they're, they're up against a benchmark. And year in and year out, the overwhelming majority of these professional money managers do not outperform the benchmark they're trying to achieve, which in my mind says they're just not that good at it. It, it, it makes sense. Again, this is common sense. If you think they're, they're doing all this research, but they're really trying to figure out what companies or what stocks are going to do well in the future. It's very much not unlike trying to figure out what the weather is going to be like three weeks from now, five weeks from now, years from now. The future is unknown and is unknowable. So this is why we don't believe in picking individual stocks. We manage money differently. If you'd like to know more, please give us a shout, shoot me an email. Uh, but again, do your own research. It'll only confirm everything I'm telling you, quite frankly. Hope this helps. Hope this makes sense. If you have any questions in the future you'd like me to answer, please send me an email at tim.curran at lpl.com. Have a great rest of the week. Have a, have a great Easter coming up. And as always, please mind your state of mind. Take care.